So good morning. I wanted to go over a quick tech tip on how to do the preference sheet. If you want an easy way to get the preference sheet done by the end of the week, uh, since it's just a, a piece that we all have to do. Um, and again, it's uh, this is just a tech tip. So what's going to happen is you're going to go here. You can go to the teachers, uh, the HFT website, and you can uh, download it right here. So you go right to here. You'll be able to download the PDF right here. If you want to download the fillable PDF, which is what I've done, the fillable PDF is right here, and I've actually filled that out online. Then what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to download it and then upload it. Now, to download it, all you need to do is click up here and download it with your changes. But here's the thing, keeping your life organized. Don't just save it. This is the thing you want to do. You want to do your last name, first name, preference, sheet 21, 22. All right, and make sure you save it that way. I'll move myself aside here. The reason you want to do that is you're going to be sending it to your administrator and to your uh, union rep. You can use me if you want at Buckley. And the reason it becomes important is we're going to get hundreds of these and or dozens of these. And it's going to be very hard to look through piles of, of files to know what they are. If you're doing this in Microsoft Word, you fill out the same information and, again, save it the same way. Last name, first name, preference sheet 2122. That's going to make sure that your material doesn't get lost. So then if I go over to my email, I go to new message, right? So I'll go into here and I'll attach it. So I'll browse this computer and I put it on my desktop because I'm going to delete it in a minute. Don't put everything on your desktop. But Tush John 122 PDF, and you can send the PDFs in or you can send the Word documents in, whatever that works. You're going to copy it to your, uh, copy it to your supervisor and copy it to uh, your union person. If you want to send it to me until we have a union rep, that's fine. Um, just let me know, and I'll be glad to hold on to them. And then you click send. I will hold on to the copy for whoever becomes our union rep um, just for the time being. And of course, your supervisor will have the copy. But please do make sure that you put your first name and last name and do realize that it's available to you on uh, the union website. Thanks so much for watching.